Parking Wars is a place where you can park your mount in the available parking spots. Where in Parking Wars, there are four parking spots available. Where if you park your mount at one of the spots in Parking Wars, you will be able to get lots of valuable rewards, according to the type of mount you parked. Where the higher the rarity of the mount you park, the better the rewards you can get. Please remember that the mount only gives maximum rewards after 8 hours of parking. After that, if the mount wants to be parked again, the rewards will be reduced significantly. But before we start discussing parking wars, I want to share four simple steps that can get you the best and most generous offers on Legend of Mushroom in the following message. Mushroom. The first step is to download Legend of Mushroom using link that I have provided in the video description. After completing downloading and installing Legend of Mushroom, then we go to the second step. You download an application called AppCoin's Wallet from the Aptoid website or from the App Store and Google Play. Choose whichever method is most convenient for you. And the third step, after AppCoin's wallet is installed you can set up payment using your credit card or PayPal account, or you can use the top-up method, which is more convenient in my opinion. After that we go to the fourth and final step, here you enter my code in the rewards tab in AppCoin's. The code is ALUM77. After applying this code you can get an extra bonus of 5% in AppCoin's credits for every purchase you make in Legend of Mushroom, which I think is quite a generous offer at this time. Thank you Aptoid. So what are you waiting for? Download Legend of Mushroom now using my link and code, ALUM77, and get this best offer as soon as possible. Now, let's go back to the video. And in Parking Wars, you can find several types of parking lots. The first is the personal parking lot, where this parking lot is the first one you will find, and usually doesn't have any buffs. And to get buffs, you have to buy and install decorations so you can get buffs to your character stats, while also increasing the number of rewards you can get. The second type is friends or search lots, where here, you can search for parking lots that may already have a bigger buff than your parking lot. The main key here is to look for friends or parking lots who have much bigger buffs than you, so that you can get maximum rewards. The third type is public lots, where parking lots are the best parking, because they provide a very large buff at the start of the game. However, you need to pay attention, because this parking lot is open to the public, this means that anyone can park their mount. If you have less power, there is a greater possibility that you will be displaced from this parking lot and ultimately make your parking time wasted. So my advice, if you want to park in public lots, make sure you have a lot of power so you don't get kicked easily. And after you successfully park your mount, you will get several valuable rewards, one of which is parking points, where you can use parking points to buy items at Automart. Where the items available at Automart are useful items to increase the buff in your parking wars, thereby increasing the bonus rewards you can get. And if you have parking lots with good buffs, then it's possible that friends or other players will be interested in parking their mounts in your parking lot. And at that time, you can make a parking fee, ranging from 5% to 20%, where every time a player successfully parks their mount, they will pay a fee according to what you have determined. But keep in mind, that they will not pay any fees if they are attacked while parking in your parking lot. And besides parking your mount, you can also plunder the mounts of friends or other players, where for every win, you will get 20% of their parking coins. The more plunders you successfully do, the more temporary buffs you will receive on attack, HP, and defense. However, if you fail to attack, then you have to wait 15 minutes before you can plunder again. And for each failure, the cooldown time will be longer. And besides parking and plundering, you can also do mount remodeling, where this mount remodeling functions as a buff on your parking lots, where your mount can be upgraded using mount XP, and if your mount level gets higher, the buff in your parking lots will also increase, as will the rewards and parking coins that can be obtained every minute. This means that the more often you park your mount in parking lots, whether at your place, a friend's, or the public, the more you can get mount XP which you can then use to upgrade your mount level, which will benefit your own parking lot. But don't forget to display your mount in your parking lot, so that the buff can be activated. Overall, parking wars can be said to have a mechanism that is quite similar to dormitory. However, what makes it different is the buff, where you can get more rewards as your buff increases. And of course this will increase your character's power growth significantly. And if you have questions or other opinions regarding this discussion, feel free to share them in the comments section. And we will meet again in the next Legend of Mushroom video.